It does the shifting up and down correctly, as we would with a manual transmission. It's effective. It definitely doesn't have a feel of a scooter. It doesn't ever feel like you're stuck in too high of a gear, you're stuck in too low of a gear. It's doing things for you that you would already do as a rider. Very good impression. So it's a lot smarter than I am as far as shifting goes, so. I think it's better than expected. User friendly to ride it around. Trying to move your left foot to shift, it's definitely different and it takes some time to get used to. But once I got used to it, I love it. It's notably faster than I can shift a motorcycle. You feel it when it shifts, but it's smooth the whole way through. I don't know how else can be smoother than this one. I think that smoothness has a big advantage when you're riding a person uh, on the back because now they're not banging their helmet against your helmet. And she winds up hitting her head, her helmet on my helmet, and then I know she's asleep so I have to wake her up. This knows when you want to shift and it really is quite amazing. I've put it through every situation I can think of, being stuck and everything else, and shocking really how well it's performed. That's really good shift pattern for the kind of riding that I do. And my friends always come up to me and say, hey man, how come your bike is so fast? It's only 670 cc. I'm like, that's the reason why, because that one split second in the shifting is what makes a huge difference when you ride it. So DCT gives you that option. So far, I've been very happy and satisfied with what it has to offer. So.